Mirfab is a pilot line. And what do I mean by a pilot line? We're using very mature technologies. We're using lasers from Nanoplast. We're using detectors from Vigo. We're using the silicon photonics technology from CEA and Leti, or the silicon photonics from technology from IMEC. We are using technologies that are already in the market, and we are combining them, putting them together in a system. Our idea is to commercialize these systems by 2020. We're going to have to spend the next four years working really hard on putting this in what we call a manufacturing production line. But it's not ready today. So when we ask companies to participate to help us making this production line, we have to help them a little bit. They are taking a bit of risks. Some companies, when they speak to you, they will say, hey, why do I have to go to you now if in four years you will be commercially available? And today you are just in development phase. Well, if you come with us today, we're going to help you. We're going to co-finance the production of your prototype. Imagine that you have a company and you're trying to make a CO2 sensor to detect CO2 in a greenhouse. Well, what we can do with you is we can study how we can use the MIRFAP technology, the sensors that we're going to make in this project, to make sure that they fit your spec. And if they fit that, we're going to write a proposal together. And the very, very smart commissioners of the project are going to take that proposal and study whether it's feasible and if it is. Up to 70% of the cost are going to be funded by the project. We are talking up to 230,000 euros to make sure that you get your first prototype. You will be an early adopter, you will be beating your competition to the market, and in four years, when the MIRFAB is commercially available, you will be already having your production, your, your prototype in your hand and looking for the production. So at the end of the day, this pilot line is going to make this huge step that there is from using today's technologies from very mature companies, from very leading companies, into a system, a package system, a module that can serve an application. We are here to develop a pilot line to fit the specifications of companies in Europe. We want to help the companies in Europe be the first ones to put these products in the market. So whenever we are talking about making a sensor to detect any kind of gas, or any kind of liquid, or to detect chemicals in any kind of solid, what we want to do is to help them make their need as soon as possible as a product in the market. And that's how we're going to do it. We're going to ask these companies what they need to do. We're going to help them. And we're going to help them not only by making the prototype, but also co-financing the production of that prototype. So when you have a need, you can write a proposal to us. We will actually evaluate to see if it's actually feasible and if it's one of the best proposals that we receive, we can, we can co-finance it, which means that you will have the prototype and around 70%, up to 70% of the cost of that prototype will be paid by the project. And even if it's not selected as one of the best proposals, what we're going to do is also help you and try to see where we can actually make it outside the project, of course financed by you, but you will be still one of the first ones in the market. Nevertheless, in 2020, this will be a commercial fab. This will be commercially available. Nevertheless, in 2020, you can come to us and you will have the production made for you. But if you come to us now, you will be first. What is a MIRFAB enabled product? A MIRFAB enabled product is a system integration of different mature components. Some of them already commercially available. What we're going to do is we're going to do a smartly system integration in a way that it can be automatized and suitable for the, mod, the, the volume production needed by the market. It is not so easy to have this these components integrated, you need the very smart knowledge of companies such as CISEM, CE such as IMEC, top level system integrators. You need the lasers from companies like Nanoplast, ARPS lasers. You need the detectors from companies like Vigo. You need the platforms, the silicon photonics platforms from CEA Leti on IMEC. And you need the most important thing here, you need the demands of the market. And if you have all this in the mix, the idea is to use the knowledge of the system integrators in this consortium to make your product come true.